All right, let's take a look outside this morning. We are waking up to a deep marine layer across San Diego County. We're starting to see a little bit more visibility out of our El Cajon sky cam, but all we're seeing is really a giant cloud over the camera, and you see the cloud coverage out of downtown San Diego at this hour. We're waking up in the upper 60s, low 70s along our coastline. 67 degrees right now in Carlsbad. We're in the upper 60s inland as well. 68 in Escondido, Poway, and El Cajon, and we are in the 80s in our deserts. Today's highs, we don't have far to go to hit our daily highs along our coastline at least we're going to be in the low 70s. Oceanside going to be one of the warmer spots in the mid 70s today. We're going to be in the mid to upper 70s in our inland neighborhoods. Escondido and Poway looking at a high of 76. We'll be in the 70s in our mountains and below the triple digit mark in our deserts. Low pressure is impacting San Diego County and you know it's really shaking things up. It's bringing us a slight chance for showers. The best time we could see them is really overnight trickling in. This is 11 p.m. Sunday. You see a cell between Carlsbad and Del Mar really impacting our coastal neighborhoods. This is what things could look like on your morning commute tomorrow. You see some showers impacting our North County as well as Del Mar stretching into some of our inland neighborhoods like Poway and Santee. We could see that shower activity throughout most of the morning. Then we'll start to clear out with just clouds in the afternoon. Then the chance for rain will subside Tuesday into Wednesday. And it doesn't look like we're going to collect much rainfall at all overnight and through Monday. It looks like about a tenth of an inch at best in places like Oceanside. Looks like less everywhere else around the county. This low pressure is also bringing some gusty winds especially to our deserts. You see that this afternoon we could see gusts up to 40 miles per hour in Ocotillo Wells. Flash forward about 24 hours, we could see those gusts grow to about 50 miles per hour in Ocotillo Wells. Taking a look along our coastline over the next seven days. It's a beautiful day to head outside even though it is cloudy out there. I know there's lots of things happening. We had mentioned the El Grito event happening this afternoon in Chula Vista. Looks like temperatures are going to be pretty comfortable out there. We are going to start off the event in the 70s, wrap it up in the mid 60s. We could see a very slight chance for some shower activity as that event wraps up. And it looks like we're going to remain in the low 70s over the next seven days in our coastal communities until we hit Saturday. Then we'll be in the mid 70s. We'll start to see a nice warm up across the county. We're going to be in the 70s over the next seven days in our inland neighborhoods. Our mountains are going to drop down significantly tomorrow. They're looking at a high of 58. Then we'll jump back up to the mid 60s Tuesday into Wednesday. Our deserts not seeing the triple digits over the next seven days.